It's June 22nd, 2020. Back for another Garden Diaries update. It stormed a lot yesterday, which I'm thankful for because the garden got a lot of water that it needed. And it's supposed to rain some more this week. This morning, I picked two yellow squash two cucumber. This is one of the burpless and this is one of the bush pickle. And this little squash I picked because it was rotten. That's blossom end rot. So I'm hoping I don't have a lot of problems with that but you're supposed to pick it off as soon as you see that problem. But these two yellow squash look really good. Um, this is, these are not the first cucumbers. I picked my first cucumber I think Wednesday or Thursday. We have another cucumber coming on. This is the burpless again. I think these are like English cucumbers or something. It's funny because the other cucumber I picked was from this one, which in one of my earlier videos I mentioned this one I had picked off the sprout leaves and I said I wouldn't do that again. Well, it's given me the two biggest cucumbers so far. So I don't know. That's kind of weird. We're just we're just trying to learn, you know. Um, the storm yesterday blew two of my squash plants over. This morning they had kind of righted themselves up, but when I picked the squashes earlier, that one fell over again. Now the squash that I had lost a couple weeks ago. I think they're trying to come back. This one doesn't have any leaves yet. But this one over here, it's got some, if you can see it, it's got some fresh leaves coming on right there. But honestly, with the ones that I lost, it just provided more space for everything. The mammoth Russian sunflowers, which are these, they're getting huge. I didn't end up needing to plant any more sunflowers. I don't have any space now. This squash, I'm waiting to see if it gets bigger in the next couple days, but it's so cute. It's two squash in one. The broccoli and cabbage, they're doing really good. You can see this big hole here. I had to pick a tomato plant. It was dying. Here it is. I don't know why, but now I'm losing another tomato plant too. I don't know if maybe I burned them up by adding that extra bit of fertilizer last week. Some of them are looking really good, but I'm nervous about a few of them. So we'll see. They're just so big and bushy and they have blooms. And I only one tomato plant out here has one little tomato on it. It's like they have all the blooms and then the blooms fall off. They also have some curly leaf going on. When I Googled this though, it told me it could be environmental stress, too much water, not enough water. So basically, it could be anything. That's kind of what that told me. The onions are doing really good. They're growing next to the cabbage and broccoli. The green cabbage and broccoli have taken off. Um, some of my green cabbage and down there and the broccoli down there had some pest issues. I haven't been able to find the pest, but I have been inspecting it, see if I can find it and smush it. We did have a huge potato beetle on the potatoes this morning. I killed it. I haven't found any potato beetle eggs. Um, honestly, now there's just too many leaves to look for them in this heat. If I had gotten up earlier, maybe it wouldn't be so bad. But it's like 90 degrees out here right now. Two of our pepper plants. One of them is a bell pepper right here. It's not doing too great. The eggplant, they still aren't doing great, but you know what, they're hanging in there. So like I said before, I'm not giving up on them. The other pepper plant is a banana pepper. It's not doing too good either. I healed it up today around the base to see. Also that tomato plant that looks like we're gonna lose, I healed it up too. But we've got tons of banana peppers coming on. 
I haven't picked them yet. I just don't know how much bigger they're gonna get. So, we will see. Tomatillas, are, we got them like crazy, but none of them are ready to pick. Oh, this week I did plant one regular potato right there. I think I mentioned that in the last video though. But yeah, we're starting to get some fruits of our labor. So far just cucumber and squash, but hey, I like cucumber and squash, so I'll take it. All right, have a great day.